start. All right, hey guys, here with uh, with Ray Pope at the gathering. We are uh, finishing up this last day. We got our coffee. Ray, you got coffee? Over yeah, there? I got coffee. All right, yes. we got to get our day started with there coffee. We go. <laughs> <laughs> so we uh, we're just reflecting on the show, and it was a great show. And <clears throat> got to share some good ideas, and Ray's like, "Man, we ought, we ought to do this." So what I do on the plates, whenever they laser cut them. And plates are cut out of uh, out of flat stock, rolled flat stock. Most plates, unless they're machined. And if they're machined, they're going to be really expensive. But they're cut out of uh, rolled flat stock. And when they cut them, the heat slightly. You guys ever have a plate that you put on the disc and it's not quite right? It so just doesn't want to quite sit level, and you're you're pushing trying to get it, and it doesn't seem like it wants to go. Yep. Dennis Dennis told me he marks them all top and bottom. Yeah. Uh, for what? Well, so yeah, there's a top and a bottom. Here's why. Yeah, there's a top and a bottom, believe it or not. Recently, I started working them because, uh, like Ray said, we put it on the disc, it doesn't work right. So I set it on granite. I clean all any burrs that might be left over. I set it on granite and look at this one. See how it's spinning there, Lauren? All right, spinning like that. So if we flip it over, it'll spin. Yeah. That's because this disc here, because of the heat and the way it's cut, this disc here has a slight cup. So we flip it over like this, it won't spin, it'll go down. That's just something when you guys do it. When you when you put your your material on it, whether it's salt, whatever, just make sure you've got the cup down so it sits solid on your platform. Yep. That way right. it won't rock and it, plus it'll it'll extend the life of the magnet on the platinum. Because if you put them on and they are rotating, the magnet doesn't get a good grip. And when you kick the machine on, especially if you start mid-speed, it'll it'll spin a little bit. You'll hear that when you turn it on. Every time you do that, you're taking life out of your magnet. There you go. So, All right, cool. Tip of the day. Have a good one, guys. Take care.